Welcome to the Boombox. I'm Georgette Klein. And this is Tim Hotep. And this is the New Music Minute. There's a whole world out there full of music. We're going to put you up on the newest and the latest. First thing we're going to talk about is Young Thug's 1017 Thug 2 mixtape. Nice. A totally unauthorized mixtape. Young Thug, he's did the songs, but they're putting it out just because they want to put it out. Not his team, but whatever. Anyway, it's all the Young Thug we expect. It's kind of a cross between Lil B mixed with Lil Wayne. Him just being very, very strange. In fact, my favorite song on there is probably Strange Things, which is him being all sedated, but still trying to be seductive while talking to the ladies. And my next favorite song on there is the song with Quavo, Sub-Zero, which is, of course, about how cold they are. A rap album that I'm looking forward to is Joel Ortiz's House Slippers. Ah, like Chancletas. Uh, yes, okay. exactly. So he's at his most comfortable here. He left his Slaughterhouse crew for a little bit so he could shine as a solo artist. Uh, you know, this is the first uh, record that he's done since 2011's Free Agent. And the title track here, he's also at his most comfortable. One of the lines that I like, really like, is I'm just trying to wrap my ass off because, of course, he does just that. I'm just trying to wrap my ass off, hoping maybe I'll impress a few niggas from back in the day because I'm finishing these new niggas that's rapping today. Are you a fan of Moody R&B? I mean, who isn't? Mm, well, I'm pretty sure you're gonna like Party Next Door then. Are you familiar with him? I am. Oh, okay, well, he's coming out with a new project called Party Next Door 2. Oh, the sequel? The sequel, yes. Last year he came out with the self-titled effort, and of course, this is the follow-up. So on this effort, there's 12 tracks and only one featured guest. Can you guess who that is? Probably Drake. Yes, it is Drake. He signed to OVO Sound, which is of course Drake's label. And you know, when Party Next Door first came out, people kind of wrote him off like he was gonna be another, you know, weekend twin. But you know, he has his own unique flavor. And if you're into moody R&B, you know, songs about the ladies, and of course, living the lavish life, then he's really for you. So check it out. Um, I'm a fan of the rhythm and blues myself, you know. Right now, I've been listening to The Dream's new project, Royalty, the prequel EP. It's pretty dope. Um, it's all the stuff that we expect to hear from The Dream. So it's, you know, it's ratchet, it's catchy, but it's also very, very melodic. And it marks his reuniting with Tricky Stewart, his producer. It's seven songs, and it's really dope. Definitely check out the song Culture, which is like, takes tricking on women to brand new heights. It's amazing. You love it. <laughs> Now let's talk about this culture, culture, culture. Thanks for watching the New Music Minute. Let us know what you think and hit us on Twitter at The Boombox. Take you out of culture, culture, culture. Join this culture.